Hey everybody, Boom Shakalaka back again with my first time playthrough of Medieval for the PlayStation 4. Thought we were facing off against Z Zarok. Zarok now. But apparently we've got uh, got to go to the time time device first. Zarok. <laughs> apparently he's building a uh, time machine. That is not good. That's all I've got to say about that. We got a bridge here. Glad we turned around. Got some gold. And let's see what awaits us down here. Oh shit. What am I doing here? We do have that, uh... Let's see, where is that thing? I want to try this thing out here. I mean, who wouldn't? Huh. No, it's getting something up there. Hey, the hell? These little flying things. I, I can't be messing around here. When the end game here, I can't be messing around with my uh, light files. As much as I love to try out new weapons. Oh, where these guys pop up? Using a dark magic called science, Zarak has constructed a device based around the mechanical measurement of time. The innards of this chronograph are fiendishly complicated. Keep your eye on the flying timepieces and get ready to reset the hands of the master time clock. Hmm. Whoa! Wasn't expecting that. Oh, they're trampolines. Cool. I thought I saw a little path down this way. Let's check this out before we... <laughs> uh, those things look sharp. Whoa. As does that. Whatever the hell that thing is. Whew. It does hurt ya. I figured. Just chilling there. Because I have a clue where we were right behind them. Let's uh let's jump up here a minute. Oh crap, there's that. There's another one of those guys. To a certain time, I just don't know what. Well, it looks like it's going to be 4.05. Oh, I, I was already there. In a circle we go. That did it. I'm gotta be honest, I'm a bit bummed that this is looking to be one of the last levels. Ooh, what the hell? And especially so that they didn't did, didn't uh, remaster or remake. Medieval 2. Because I'll, even though I'll probably still play that one on my PlayStation Classic, I want to 
is this? Oh, lost soul, okay. Even though I'll pro probably play Medieval 2 on my PlayStation Classic, because I did mod that sucker. Um, yeah, it, it would have been so much better playing it with these updated visuals and everything. Oh, so that's the Earth Rune, but uh, there's no way I'm stepping in that thing. Uh, so, okay. Let's see here. Yeah, I'll do the trick. Sweet. And... Okay, cool. Earth room now. Yeah, it's really. I was looking up a uh, walkthrough from Medieval 2 earlier, and it looks like a really cool. <laughs> what been pissed. There's another path over here I saw. But it looks like in that game you start off and a museum, I think, or a university or something, in London, which, oh, wow, made it past all the giant mechanical bird things, only to get pushed off by a giant wheel, oh, and now I'm really screwing up here, those damn birds. Bats and birds, those are the main things you gotta watch out for in this game. But yeah, I think that game even looks like it may have been longer than than this one. There were like 30 levels I thought. It's like, man, I really wanna play that. It's just gonna be a lot harder to uh, go and play that after having played the remake of one. Shoot these guys from a fire, why not, you know? Beautiful. This metal keep houses the magical chariot that Zerok calls his train. The path that runs along leads eventually to Zerok's lair. However, your route is blocked by gates controlled at various way stations. Travel to these on the train, open the gate. Okay. So yeah, I don't know what other remakes they they came up with the Crash Bandicoot remake with the original trilogy, and then Spyro, which I, I've never played any of these Spyro games, so would love to get around to those. You know, three solid 3D platformers right there. I will eventually get around to that. Well, all these PlayStation 1 games being remastered. Or remade, really. Oh, Final Fantasy. Final Fantasy 7, too. I mean, that's. That'll be out soon. That's a big one. Everyone's looking forward to that, which I haven't played any of the Final Fantasy games, so. I'd say the top series that I haven't. Never, uh really delved into would be, uh, let's see here, <laughs> so all you have to do is enchant that sword once and it just stays enchanted forever, is, am I reading that right? Wow, okay then, um, but yeah, uh, Final Fantasy, I've never played. Kingdom Hearts, never played. Metal Gear Solid, I've never played any of those games. 
let me scoot over. Oh, <laughs> lucky bastard. And this enchanted sword sure is powerful. Um, and there's many others. Silent Hill. Never played any of those games. So there's all kinds of first-time playthroughs that I'm excited to get to. I'm sure there's many that I'm forgetting. And of course, just as many game, mini series where I've played a few games, but haven't gotten around to some of the major ones. Like Zelda, I've played some of the earlier ones, but I've never played like Wind Waker or Breath of the Wild. So yeah, very. Excited to play some of those. Bam! Oh, hell yeah. Can't imagine what we would be able to unlock at this point, though. Hmm. Ah, uh, there's another. Another one on that side. Let's see here. Scoot along here. Boom, boom, boom. Man, this thing is powerful. If you remember earlier, in the sleepy village where we first came across those guys, and we did not have the enchanted sword, yeah, we could not take care of them like we are now. Sure helps to have good uh, good equipment. And we have arrived, and that gate is now open for us. So let's. Uh Although that chalice is available now. Which I think... Where was that sucker again? Oh uh, yeah. You know what, we got enough life that we can uh, make a go for it here. Let's not screw this up now. There it is. There's that sucker. Sly Cooper, though, have never played those. Jack and Daxter. Oh, yeah. Uncharted. Now, there's a series that uh, I'm excited to get to. And a lot of, like, Horizon Zero Dawn. Uh, a lot of one offs, too. Which, that's a game. This generation, Sony has just killed it. I don't think a. Uh, We've seen a better generation from any of the, the big game companies than what Sony has pulled off this generation. It's just one massive hit after another. And Microsoft has nothing to show for it. Nintendo is doing great with the Switch. I mean, they've had a better year this year. 2019 than than Sony has even. They got Pokemon coming out coming out here in a couple weeks. Although Sony Sony does have Death Stranding coming out here, so it's not been a uh, bad year for Sony by any means either. Oh Danielle. I've got something here I can give you, but I've no idea what it is. 
Do you fancy a little gamble, Mike? Sweet. I will take that. I need as much as I can, uh, as much as I can get on a final boss fight. Ooh. Looks nice. Almost got all of them now. So off to fight Zarek we go.